Bills can be scary, change can be scary, but neither has to be. That's why we want to discuss the new electric rate structure at GRU. On October 1st, GRU switched to a two-tier structure similar to what many utilities use across the country. Under the new rate structure, customers will pay 4.3 cents per kilowatt hour up to 850 kilowatt hours per month. Customers will pay 6.4 cents per kilowatt hour for all the electricity they use above 850 kilowatt hours. For some customers, this will mean an increase in your monthly bill. But for many, it will result in a decrease. If you use 1,000 kilowatt hours per month, the industry standard usage comparison, your bill will decrease from $140.50 in 2015 to $138.10 in 2016. Customers will see a few other changes on their bill. Natural gas customers will see only a slight increase of 95 cents in the base rate, so we're still among the cheapest in the state. Wastewater will see a base rate change of $1.65, and water will see a base rate change of $2.80. Speaking of water, did you know that we have one of the purest water supplies in the nation? So why did these changes occur? We found that only 3% of all GRU customers took advantage of our old conservation rate tier, using less than 250 kilowatt hours per month. Also in 2014, the Gainesville City Commission adopted an electric rate goal of staying in the middle of the pack for all Florida utilities. And this change to the electric rate tier keeps us on track. Finally, GRU gives more than $35 million to the city each year, known as the General Fund Transfer. This money helps support city services such as police, fire rescue, and parks and recreation. The rate changes keep us on track to meet that goal. So hopefully, the only scary thing coming to your door this October will be trick-or-treaters. Visit gru.com for more information.